Everybody good? Everybody ready? Yes, sir. We're about to go live? Yes, sir. We're about to, about to do it right now. All right, let's get it. All right. All right, guys, welcome to episode 155 of Dope Talk TV. It's yours truly, Low Key. Got John here with me. And today, we have a very special guest. Master Q is in the motherfucking building. Y'all make some noise, man. Go down in the fucking description if you haven't done so already. Get yourself some merch. Go check out the Patreon. And uh, yeah, man, he's going to be our next guest on Patreon as well. So if y'all want to check out some real talk, man, go over there. And uh, subscribe over there, man. But how we feeling, boys? How we feeling? How we feeling? Feeling phenomenal. And I appreciate you, low key. You know yeah, what I mean? Sure, and man, my homie sure. Johnny, you know what I mean? Third yeah. side. We know Third the vibe, side, man. You yes, know what's up. You, you know what's me. up. Round of applause, Master Q, man. Popping up, making it through, making time, you know, for the show and, you know, showing love. For yeah, sure. Hey, appreciate y'all sure. having sure. me, low yeah, key. You know what I mean? You know Straight how it on. go. You know how it go. Yes, man, indeed. My dog, man. You, you've been doing it all, man. You've been doing it all, bro. Like, you've been jumping out of planes. You've been rapping. You've been, you've been doing a lot of different things, bro. You know, and we proud of you, bro. For real. Keep going, man. Nonstop. I appreciate you know that, I mean? man. Glory to God. Thank you. Thank yeah, you, bro. Okay, bro. Gotcha, I really bro. appreciate that, man. Yeah. Repeth. Repeth. It's work, man. You've been putting in that work for sure, man. You but don't... yeah, bro. Y'all y'all motherfuckers grew up together a little bit, word, man. Let word, the people word. know, yeah, man. Yeah, Let yeah, them we grew up together, man. man. What's yeah, up? Bro. Third <laughs> side. Yeah, we grew Whoa. up together, bro. I met him when I was 13 years old, bro. That's why I met a lot of people, man. And, uh, yeah, bro, we always stayed in contact. We went to high school together. You know what I mean? And it's, it's always been a good vibe, bro, between me and him. Word, bro. And, He's uh, a genuine guy, man. Genuine and it's guy. crazy because me and him been seeing each other for years, bro. Word. Years. Okay. Like, Word. You know, we were the same people. Yo, yeah, we I'm hung saying. around the same crowd. We fucking went to the same school. Hung around each other 10 feet away from each other on the stairs, bro, and never had a conversation till today. Ain't that word. some shit? Yeah, bro. <laughs> That's crazy. I'm saying, yo, but, word. Yeah, Life bro. be like that, right? Yeah, but we grew up around the same city, man, in the same, you know, third side, bro, over here is known as third side. And yeah, man, like, it was, it was a good time growing up, boys. I'm not going to lie. It was yeah. some shit going on, but it was, yeah, it was some fun, yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. <laughs> Niggas survived. Yeah. <laughs> That's all that matters. And a lot, and we a lot didn't. It, I mean? And a lot didn't. Yeah, we yeah, made it, a lot bro. didn't. Yo, rest in peace to everybody that did. Yeah, Yo, this Straight out to them. We yeah. were just talking everybody about that. that you know what I'm saying? And, uh, you know, we don't want to make the podcast all sad, but yeah. we, we were going through a, a little list of names. And not a little list. It was a list yeah. of names of people that, that passed away. That yeah, passed sure. away that we grew up with. And, you know, rest in peace to them. Uh, y'all will forever live in our hearts, bro, because it was, it was great times growing up. For, nah, for real. Uh -huh. Yeah, but but yeah, yeah, man. Let's get straight into it, guys. Word let's up, get straight up. into it. My dog jumped. My dog jumped off a plane, man. I didn't even know. <laughs> out of a million years, I never thought you would even do that, bro. You know man. what I mean? I never, bro. You were out in Alaska. You were out there in the snow. Yeah, like you were in the go. snow, snow. Word, y'all. Like, and how was that? What did you see over there, man? What kind of shit? Oh my god <laughs> Fucking bears Moose and shit Yo Wow Yo for real Yeah And then you know what I mean Like the, the snow would be getting like Three feet You know what mm. I'm saying For real mm. yeah. Two feet you gotta shovel that And I'll be shit. jumping in that shit You feel oh me And like god. Yeah man It was Man the military was awful bro. Yo. My experience as an airborne <laughs> infantry man Yo no, Never no, again, you know, never again. Mm -hmm. you know what's crazy I've heard that That you know like the guys that do specifically what you did, like they end up losing like a sense of fear, or some shit. Like supposedly, to, like to jump out of an airplane or some shit, like you lose like a certain sense of like because you're willingly jumping out of a good aircraft that you you don't have to jump out of, my nigga. Word. It's flying, fine. Mm -hmm. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like for real. So it's like, do, did you experience that? Like, did you lose any fear? Like, did you like were you ever scared of heights or anything like that? Well, well. When I first started jumping, you know what I'm saying? Like, I was like, ah, you know, everybody's got that, you know, those the bugs, butterflies. And the bugs. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, it was wild. But then all of a sudden, it's like as soon as I did that first jump, it was just work mm. from there. Like, that's just what it was. Like, you know, and the military was like, yo, you're jumping out this fucking plane. <laughs> yeah. The fuck away around it. You know what I mean? Like, nah, yeah, sure. like you know what I'm saying? Like, so it was just. Five, four, go. three, two, yeah. go. And it means, <laughs> right. Yeah, you know, we, we had a 10 second count, but yeah, it yeah. means, you know what I mean? <laughs> Yeah, real shit. Shit. yeah, but uh, it means a lot to me as well because, um, like on my arm with the airborne tattoo, you feel me? I'm mm. a third generation airborne. Wow. So rest so in peace to my grandfather and my father, but wow. they were they were airborne as well. That's, that's, that's respect. That's third cool, bro. Yeah, that's really cool. Round of applause to that man. That's salute, man. Thank you for serving our our country, bro. Honestly, like. It takes big cojones to just be just, like, nah, I'm going to yeah. like willingly go do this. Not get drafted. 
Like I'm gonna go do this You know what I'm saying Like yeah. So salute bro That's a different type of heart That's a that different ass. type of mentality Repeto. bro Repeto. Real Repeto. talk Real talk bro Real I always wanted talk. to kill a fucking moose too <laughs> Yo, 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 they just shit. yo, they just stand in your way. They're big. Yo, they'll literally they like you'll be driving. Shit? No, they don't care. Yo, they have, you talk shit. about no fear. Mooses ain't got no fear. <laughs> For real, yo, you'll be driving. They'll just sit there. Fuck big as a motherfucker. Here, they'll just sit there. They don't go after your car or nothing On like no that. On a real B, oh they don't. They just sit there. That's like crazy. they don't. They don't. They don't do nothing active. But they'll just sit there. Big as fuck. Nah. Wow, bro. They don't care. That's crazy. I mean, you they, can't just like run them over. You're gonna fuck your car up. I never, I never seen a moose, bro. I never seen one. You, yeah, know, you know what's crazy? Big as fuck, bro. And them I shit ain't no Florida deer, bro. Yeah, huge. Them shits ain't Florida deer. Our Florida deer are pretty fucking small. Like even if you go right. to other states, like other states have pretty big deer. Our deer are fucking scrawny. Like that's crazy. Them moose are even, big as shit. Even like the black bears that they have out in Florida mm -hmm. and shit, smaller, small as fuck. Than the bears in Alaska. Oh, my oh man, fuck that. You run into brown bears yeah. up there, like uh, grizzly and, bears and shit, and polar bears, bro. Nah, fuck <laughs> them. <laughs> Fucking awful, bro. That's you ever, yo, you see the a polar bear, bear, right? And yeah, that's just, bro. The po no, it's not the best bear. It's the biggest and that's wildest what I mean. That's what I said. It's yeah, like the, the biggest bear there yeah, is. Yeah, the polar bear is huge, and yeah, it's yeah, wild. That's, and that's some other shit, man. That's crazy, man. Yeah, yeah. bro. <laughs> yeah, I've been man. to Alaska, but when I was little, it was like a little cruise, you know. Mm -hmm. And that was it. That's I didn't really remember shit. Where'd you go to Juno by chance? I think it was Juno. Juno, yeah. yeah I see. It how, was like right. it was like some wood thing. I remember it was like something. I forgot. Yep. Yeah, yeah, you know that, was that was yeah, Juno. That was Juno. Yeah, they do a lot of the, the yeah, vacations out there. Yeah, that's yeah, dope as fuck, bro. I never knew you been to the last. Yeah, bro. And uh, when I went to Norway, you would think you would see a moose there, right? But nah, it's it's only the northern part of Norway. Mm. It's you know it. it Word. Yeah, my dad, where, where like my family's from, is like the middle, like kind of more like southern. Mm. You know, on the coast of Norway, like on the islands and shit. And I was Word. like, man, I always wanted to see a moose, bro. For real. Oh, for I, real? Yeah, yeah. Like with the big ass fucking giant ass fucking uh what do you call them? Yeah, they got the thick uh forgot it's like the branches and shit like the deers yeah, have bro. or whatever. It's like the it's fucking, like the yeah. rack, you know? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like the rack. yeah, I don't even know what you call that shit, but yeah. Damn, bro. Excuse but us, guys, we fucking high as shit, all right? Yeah, bro. Don't mind but, us. You know what? <laughs> word up, word up. Yeah, 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 yeah. We know how we do. Yeah, so, yeah, we know what we, we talk about. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, but we usually don't smoke on the show, but we said fuck it. You yeah, know nah, I mean? bro. We got a special yeah. guest. Round of applause again to Master Q for showing yeah, up, Yeah, bro. We smoking with our dog today. Fuck all that. We gonna put his link in the bio. You know what I mean for the uh, for his music. Yeah, that's you know a what fact. I mean? That was Appreciate another thing I wanted to talk to you about, bro. How long you been making music? Was it Facts. something that like you grew up with? You know, your parents were musicians and they got you into. Like, how'd it go for you? Back. I've been doing music my whole life, you know what I mean? But when I really started, like, taking it serious and then a uh, career was about five years. So, uh, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Uh, I did as soon as I got out of the military. Okay. 2016, okay. you know what I mean? So you just like during the military, like you were already planning, like yo, yeah. when I'm done, I'm gonna go to the studio. Yeah. Bro. Oh, that's yeah. what's up. Yeah, that's what's what's up. I knew it. I knew it. I was like, I'm getting out of this. <laughs> I'm starting to rap. Mm -hmm. Word. I'm nah, starting to sing. I'm doing it all. I said it's, it's going down, and that's yeah. what happened. Glory that's to God. Up. That's good, bro. That's you were you were talking about you performed in Georgia and stuff like that on Peach Street. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. At the Center Stage Theater of Peach Street. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you, yo. Yeah, bro. Round of applause. My dog out here performing different states, cross state lines. Who's doing shit. that? Yo, not a lot of people. Up, well, not that's a lot of people ain't performing fact. by itself. Because especially I'm not. not from Daltona, dog. Let's be real. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, well, well, we all have our time, right? Yeah. Feel me? And I mean, the glitters aren't always gold, mm -hmm. right? Perception isn't always reality. <laughs> you feel me? And if I yeah. was having my DJ here with me right now, and uh, you know what I'm saying, some of the other people that we had, you know, on the already famous tour that went with us, yeah. they would tell you too what we've been through. Yeah. <laughs> you feel me? Yeah. Yeah. On power. Yeah, that's crazy. I'm telling you, yeah, bro. It's the real life of the industry and shit. We already know that. You know what I mean? Right, yeah. right. Yeah, that's what's up, bro. It was lit, though. It was, it was a great experience. And, um, yeah, it's, it's all about the bitty. It's all you know about I'm saying Del Tone, yeah, third yeah, side. Yeah, bro. Hey, you got to represent, man. We were talking about that earlier. Like, you got to represent where you're from, guys. Don't ever feel like where you're from is too small or not known enough to be cool. Fuck all that. Make it cool, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, put the city out there. Put where you're from out there, bro, yeah. because... That'll motivate other people around the city. You know what I'm saying? That are like, yo, we don't have a way out or whatever the fuck. Like, we don't have no nobody to, you know, like look up to. Like, fuck all that, bro. Be the people to look up to, bro. Straight up. Yeah, On the bro. Rim. That domino effect. Yeah, yeah. man. And low key, bro. Like our city's pretty. Like we we support each other, bro. Like for yeah. the most part, we support each other, and I like that. I want it to stay like that. bro. Yeah, I like that too. That whole like being negative and like beef and shit. That shit don't get nobody nowhere, bro. Yeah, it does. We want to bring the city up. We gonna have to bring the city up. You know what I'm saying? Together. You know what I mean? Like, straight up. 
I try, I try not to I try not to get back on that frequency. That's what it's called, right? You know, because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. like we're we're right. on a higher frequency. We're on a higher level. You know what I mean? And to, yes. to bring yourself back down to that to that frequency, I can't understand that. Nah, you, you pick know, and you know your who battles. told us that was uh, that's facts. <clears throat> we had a we had a guest. He was uh he was just audio though. He wasn't actually here. Um, what was his name again? I'm sorry. Um, I forgot his name, man. To be honest. <laughs> But I remember what you said, man. You know, it's like you can't you can't bring yourself back inspire down to Inspire the free- great. Yeah, expire, inspire, yep. inspire. Inspire. Great. Inspire the great, bro. Yes. Yeah, bro. And uh, I think you follow him too. Inspire the great. Yeah, I think bro. you do, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, yeah, 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 yeah. I, I do. I do. I do follow does, him. Yeah, he yeah, does yeah. like the quotes on, on yeah, yeah, on yeah, the gram. Bro. Yeah, I actually do. Yeah, I yeah, do nah, follow listen, him. Yeah, the great. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Shout out to you, bro, because that man lost his mom and kept on fucking grinding, bro. That's hard, bro. Yeah, he lost his mom. My condolences. And the same shit to you, bro. Like anybody that loses a parent, bro, that's a different type of pain, especially when it's like premature. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't supposed to happen. Like. It's a On different type of pain, bro. So I salute y'all, bro, because that shit's hard. I, could, you know what I mean. I couldn't imagine that shit. Though. Yeah, I appreciate you, Loki. You know what I mean. Yeah, yeah bro. I appreciate you, Johnny. Yeah, bro. We already all know. Day, bro. Talk. You all day, bro. You know what I mean, bro. Because people don't respect. realize. People don't know how it feels. You know what I mean until it happens to them. Mm-hmm. Right. You see what I'm saying? Like people always want us to act like they feel bad, and they really don't give a fuck, bro. Let's just keep it a buck. That's fair. You know what I'm saying? And I rather people you, I, I rather you keep it a buck and act like you don't give a fuck instead of you trying to fake it. Word. Facts. You see what I'm Word. saying? Say the real. Say how you, you can, feel. Because yeah, you can see, facts. you can we feel only got the, one life the, to live. Yeah, you can feel the gen, like people being genuine and people like that are just trying to fake it. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know, man. That's just me though. That's my little right it's for just, the day. It's vibrations, bro. Oh, God, you know, bro. you know people that will really be there and won't. You know what I'm saying? Like, and that's just in those situations. Unfortunately, that's when you really find that shit the fuck out. You know what I'm saying? You you start finding out like, like damn, bro, like. I would have gave a fuck for you. You don't give a fuck for me. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. it's, it's fucked up, you know? And it usually hurts because it's pe- it's usually the people closest to you, bro. Always the people closest to you. That f- You know what I'm saying? Yeah, bro. That's Unfortunately. True. That's how that's sometimes. How it goes, that's how it be sometimes. Bro. Real talk. Unfortunately. Real Yo, talk. So, so, uh, so uh, Monday. Monday's coming up. You know what Monday is, right? Martin Luther King Day, man. Round of applause. For Martin Luther King. You hey. know, a visionary, a legend. You know what I'm saying? Like, he... he uh, Bro, he started a movement that's still going to today, bro, if you really think about it. Glory to God. Straight up. Glory to God. I wanted to shout out to him. You know what I'm saying? To me, that's like a prophet. (laughs) You know what I'm saying? Somebody that starts a movement that lives on beyond them. Bro, like it's years. different. It's over, different. Over a hundred years, almost getting close. Yeah, it is. Yeah, getting yeah, close it to hundred years. It's wild, right? It's, it's wild. like eighty something years, right? Seventy. Yeah, time is going by. It's wild. It's getting like that. It's fucking crazy. And uh, yeah, and Martin Luther King's house that I was talking about in Atlanta and shit like that in the King mm. Center. Yeah, it's amazing, tell, man. Yeah, tell us about that. That's bro. great dope. experience, bro. It's amazing. Like you go there, you can see at the King Center. They'll show you all of the history and everything. But then you'll also go into Martin Luther King's house as well. Wow. Mm. You know what I'm saying? You're like right that was his actual home. That was his home. Yeah. That he. Yup. And then Ebenezer Church is there as well wow. so i've been going there wow. from atlanta since you know what i'm saying from as, as like a teenager and shit uh, a couple of different times mm-hmm. but uh when i was you know an adult i went there even more you feel right. me even in the military and everything you know what i mean yeah uh, that's but cool. yeah what, what made you like go visit was there like a connection yo, yo you i got you family in atlanta yeah. you know what i'm saying and yeah. uh, uh atlanta is a very historical city i got a lot mm-hmm. of respect for atlanta bro Mm. On the real, you know, what I'm you know it's it was crazy. I love when I went. Yeah, I've passed through Atlanta, but I've never really like spent a few days there. Oh, it was you know nice. I mean? Like, it was no, nice. Atlanta is nice. Yeah, it's, the people, it's a beautiful the people city, are bro. It's a, you know, they got it's like anywhere else. You got your hood, you got this and that, but it's a it's a great city to go to go visit. They got great fucking food, bro. Like, yeah, for you know real. What I'm you know, saying? The up. culture, the soul on the real. You know what I'm saying? Like, you feel it. You know what I mean? Yeah. And I'm gonna be honest with you. I was literally like the only light skin really there. Out of like the majority, mm-hmm. yeah, Atlanta's you know? Black I, it, Hollywood. But like, it was just nothing but love, man. Yeah, real, Atlanta bro. is Black Hollywood. Yeah, yeah. that's how it is yeah. it's out there. It's Black Hollywood. You know? mm-hmm. it really that's is. Dope. I had yeah. a, I had a woman. I never forget it. I was sitting down with my dog Trey, and we were sitting at Waffle House in uh, in Atlanta, <laughs> and we're chilling, right? Waffle House in and, Atlanta. And this lady, and this I got a Waffle House story in Atlanta. <laughs> you know, and she comes up to me, and she goes, uh, "Tavy was there too." She comes up to me, and she goes, "Just like we're arguing about." Like, who's going to have the most girls and shit? You know what I mean? <laughs> who's going to get the most numbers, you know? And this girl comes up to me. She's like, right in the middle of that conversation. I don't know her. Didn't even see her in my entire life. And she goes, wow, honey, you are blessed. Blessed. And then I walks away. And uh, I was just like, wow. And that's right when we got there, too. It was well, like literally like, the first day, uh, like our first meal. And I was like, welcome to Atlanta. That was like something spiritual. Yeah, right yeah, yeah, it felt no, so was, good. It was, it was like, yo, I felt home. was glowing. Yeah. <laughs> 
I, 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 bro, I was walking around Atlanta. My dog was glowing. You know man. what I mean? I was walking around like, yeah, <laughs> bro. I never forget up. it though. It's different. It's a different breed, bro. We went out yeah. to the we went out to the club too, man. And I, I didn't yeah. have my bud with me because I was scared to just bring it with me. I ain't gonna lie to you. Mm-hmm. I left at the, the Airbnb, but uh, when but I as, when you ride in a different city, you, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it was yeah, just, you ride different. Yeah, yeah I was I was That's being facts. I was just being cautious, you know. Never lacking, but uh, you ride yeah. different. Georgia's different, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. Georgia yeah, is Atlanta different. is way yeah, different. Yeah. No, we had a strap on us. Regardless. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, 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 no, yeah, no, it's never lacking, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Never lacking, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. But we, right, you, yeah. <laughs> we went out to the club and shit, and the bouncer. I was just like, "Yo, bro, you know where I can get some bud?" Before I came in, and he came and he fucking he sat me down. We had VIP, and the girl from the back gave me like fucking like two grams. He's like, "You want high? Or you want low?" Mm. I was just like, "Give me the high, man. Give me the, give me the, the best, give me the best <laughs> shit you got." And he's like, "All right, bet." Came back, and it was like one of the workers that came and gave me the bud and shit. It was like, mm. "Yo, they had a whole ass like." Operation going on, mm. it was pretty cool. Hey man, that's how that shit I never goes. had that. Happen you know, sometimes you just find yeah. the right one. <laughs> right, yeah, yeah, on the, the right real, on the real. Yeah, so. yo, that's and that's, that's that's in every city that you know. what I'm saying I've been to. You know what I mean? Like even in L. A. That's yeah. why I call Atlanta Black Hollywood because mm-hmm. like I, re- I I compare it to L. A. In that way. Yeah. And uh, yeah, like Atlanta's wild. Long story short, when uh, I did the already famous tour, we were staying at a hotel and we went and yeah, ate at the Waffle House and all that, right? Yeah. So uh, my DJ was there with me and all. Yo, passing by the Valerio, walking back to the hotel, watching the motherfucker get stabbed, poke, just like that, bam, 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 you know what I mean? Yep. And then, oh, uh, no, yep. it's different out there. Yeah, it's real out there. Yeah, yeah I heard that. Watching the bam, bam, yep. I heard That's that in the crazy. last, like, six months, bro, like, it's been yeah. purging out there. Like, niggas been just... Wow, we were just shoot talking about like, stabbing, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, just personal. Pulled. No, no, yeah, no. Yep. that's different. You right pulled, there in front of the Valerio. Yeah. Right that in the Valerio, like, yo. Stabbed him up, yo. That's like, yo, I, I want you to feel this. Look at me in the eyes. Word. That's a different type yeah, of killer right there. That's a different there. type yeah, of killing. Yeah, yeah. Like, you deserve this. I wonder what he yeah. did. You don't yeah, know. Yeah, you don't know what the fuck he did. That's why I never get into people's business like you were talking about. Hey, bro. Because we don't know who's the bad guy and who's the good guy. You never know. You never know. You never know, bro. You know, the news may look at, you know, oh, wow, he killed six people. Well, you don't know what those six people did. Mm-hmm. Yeah, fact. To him. That's a fact. You know That's what I mean? That's a fucking fact. That's, <laughs> yo. Right. You know With saying? every situation, right. Yeah, Real talk, yeah, people just think like in a closed box, you know what I'm saying? And then especially when it's like your family that's affected by some by action or something, it's like you're already biased. You don't look at the bigger picture. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, man, you got to be open-minded and really, you know what I'm saying? You got to see what what's what and like just... You just gotta be more open minded, bro. Be open minded, yeah. On the real, so true, bro. On that's, the real, open to consciousness. Yes, Let's put it like that. Real you know talk, man? Real, real, real talk. Everybody, yo, open to consciousness, yo. Yeah, yeah bro. Real. On it's God. important, bro. It's important to just like be be open to new ideas and be open to like different shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? Without without anything new, you don't grow. Shit, you know? we, nope, straight up. We saw some different shit the other day, bro. I'm gonna tell you what, bro. <laughs> Yo, I swear, bro, this is the most craziest story ever, bro. We just You're chilling right. in the back, bro. We chilling in the backyard and shit. Me and him, me and low key. We smoking a joint, just talking about the business, you know. Work, work. It's our day off and shit. Next thing you know, it's we're in the back, just and, cooling, bro. Yo, and I'm like, man, like that's a dude dog they got. You know, they got a big dog. I've never seen that one. <laughs> Damn, that's crazy. <laughs> that's all I fucking said. I was like, man, and then we're talking, and I'm next thing you know, we're like. Rah, 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 rah. <laughs> no, bro, it was crazy, just crazy. like Tasmanian devil type like, shit. Like, like, like he was fucking mauling that. Like he was killing that little dog. Nah, and that I, nigga got mauled. No, and damn. I was just like, and I'm just like, damn. And my face was just like, what? Ate him up. Nah, John didn't know what the fuck. He was just looking through the fence like. <laughs> He was like, what the fuck? Ate him up. And then, like, the lady came out finally. She's like, she broke it up. She's like, bad Son, boy. She stopped. All this other shit. And she I'm couldn't like, couldn't stop him, though. Because yeah, he was a first, big ass dog. And she then, couldn't like, stop him. John yeah, was like, yo, yeah. John was like, damn, bro, I almost jumped over the fence and broke it up. I was like, bro, no. that's yo. not my business. No, nah, but then he nah. said, what if the dog bites you? <laughs> yeah, what if you get bit? Yo, on the rail, that's she, a fair one. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That's like you person. That's like person. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. That's like person to person. Exactly. Yeah. Well, that's a fair one right there. Yeah. yeah. That's a fair one. Come on, yo. Let's be real. Like person person, that's like man. person to person. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's a fair one. That's a fact, man. Nah. You gotta go run into your business. You gotta run that, nah. bro. See what yeah. comes yeah. out. He said that's like a pack business. of wolves, bro. You know what I mean? It looked like it, bro. Cause she has like five dogs. I said I couldn't. I can't understand that. What if they all want to just turn their back on you? That's crazy. M-O-U. you. That's wild. Yeah, it's <laughs> happened though. Even the twelve. That shit's happened before. But I feel like you just got to mis- I don't know. You got to mistreat an animal or do something. Yeah. Do that shit. Like, 
Or they're probably just tired of your ass and they want to leave. More than likely, yeah. <laughs> some wild shit. I, to be honest, yeah. It's got to be some wild shit for that to be yeah. happening. Nah, real situation. fucking talk, bro. Hey, man. Real fucking talk. I got, I got a real question, bro. What bro, up? Like, Let's hear for it, For real, man. for real, man. It just popped up in my head, man. And you know how we're, we're pretty much entertainers. You know what I mean? This is what we do. We like to give out content. We like to entertain people. Facts. You know, and it, and it deals with a lot of energy. You know what I mean? And yes. a, a lot of people don't deserve that type of energy. You know, like I'm not going to sit here and be an entertainer for certain women and women. This may, you know, vice versa. You, you feel me? You Word. don't got to sit here and entertain nobody if you're not getting nothing out of it. That's facts. Nothing. nothing. That's facts. Especially if you're getting nothing out of it. Not even fucking. Pure facts. World talk. You know what World I mean? And at the end of the Pure day, facts. you shouldn't even be fucking them. Mm-hmm. Word. Round of you see what I'm saying? He's like, like, making straight sense right now, bro. Bro, and it's just something that you got to realize, man, is that you think it's not a lot of energy because you're like, ah, man, I can handle a lot. I could do, you know, ego's a bad thing, bro. Yeah, yeah. pride. Pride's pride? the devil, dog. It's pride will, yep. Pride is the pride devil. will ruin you, you but know what I mean? Up. But it's true, man. Like, you notice when you stop giving out the energy, you notice you have more energy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, on You the really real. noticed it. Yeah, you more got, energy you to put your... into the right things, bro. Yeah. Straight up. Straight up. That's straight up, bro. And I would say you got to get... My fault, I didn't mean to cut you. And nah, all that, nah, hell no. You got to get your nah. focus in your zen, you know what I'm saying? And do what's best for you as a man. Yeah. Just like that woman. They got to do what's best for them. You know, we're all human. You mm-hmm. see what I'm saying? Yeah. Now, a man and a woman is meant to be together, right? So, okay, that's going to happen, but it's got to be the right one, the right energy, the right frequency. You know what I'm saying? That's fair. Like, I'm blessed. You know what I'm saying? I've been with my shorty three years. You know what I mean? So, I'm just holding it down. You feel mm-hmm. me? I've been out the game. You know what I'm hey, saying? Bro, my, yeah. dog. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, yo, my dog. My dog. My dog. He hung his jersey up. Yeah. yeah. He put the jersey yeah. on the wall, dog. Man. We were talking about that last episode. You yeah. Know, yeah. The I didn't through it, nigga. <laughs> yo, <laughs> nigga, been through it. Yo, and we'll talk about some crazy shit because he's gonna be on the next Patreon as well. That's so, facts. So you know what I mean? We're gonna about talk to about crazy. some. Yeah, we're gonna get into some shit. Yeah. For sure. yeah. Y'all go ahead and get that over there, bro. Like Man, we gonna we gonna talk about some shit. Yeah, bro. So, you know, energy is very important, guys. Protect your energy, bro. You know, and I know we say that a lot. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? But it's the truth, bro. You know, we got a battery pack on our ass. On yeah. our back. Yeah, you can't that. let everybody take you know? a piece Yo, of your energy. On the real, like, life is too short. You mm-hmm. feel me? So, like, for real, life is too short. Why focus on negativity? That's facts. Ain't going to get you nowhere. You know what I mean? A lot nowhere. of people, they get too focused into America, especially in America, because it's a capitalist country. So they're all about money. They're all about this. Money will never buy you happiness. Yep. Money will never buy you a state of mind. Yeah. If money makes you happy, that's sad. Because money is the the root of all evil. Yeah. You should have morals. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Morals, principle, integrity. There's certain things that don't that it it's worth more than trillions. You know what I'm saying? Like you can't put a fucking price on it. Yeah, it's priceless. You know what I'm saying? Like you gotta be you gotta be a good human being at the end of the day, bro. Like, you know, like there's there's guys that, yeah, they're they're up, they're rich and shit. You know what I'm saying? They're assholes. But at the, the end majority, of the day, bro, yep. you catch more, more, you know, you catch more flies with honey than you do fucking shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, at the end of the day, bro. Like, you you got to put, you got to, you got to kill them with kindness. Yeah. At the end of the day. On the real. That's all facts right there. Kill them with kindness. And I had right. to tell my little brother that, you know, I had some people talking negative under my, under my video and stuff. Uh, yeah, I released the music video, you know what I mean? So it was on my Lord, IG. Me. Check it out. Check it out. That shit's heat, bro. Yeah. Hey, and Lord, sorry to me. cut you off. Fuck all of y'all that went under my dog shit talking shit, bro. Y'all yeah. niggas make trash rail. ass music on I don't the know set. What the fuck y'all talking but about like, on third side? <laughs> it's <laughs> one. It's y'all one thing to be like, yo, talk shit, and then I listen to your music and it's better than mine. Facts. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. It's not. But like, who am I to say your music's trash? And who who are you to say that? Because music is kind of just it's, it's a art. Nah, but it's God, let's, let's, let's be real though. There's some shit that you hear and you're like, yo, this straight cheeks. Yes, let's be real. Yes. Right. Yeah. But, but check this out. Do you have to do that action and say of this is that? Because that's your nah. opinion. Yeah, yeah. Everyone has their opinion. So that's how I think about it as an artist. Like, you just got to put out what the fuck you want to put know, out. Yeah. You want to know why? Because Facts. there's always going to be, no matter whether you're fucking me or Jay Z, right? Or Nas, right? Or Michael Jackson, the greatest entertainer that mm. ever existed, right? Facts. On the real. There's going to be a fucking. Billion people in the world, right? Or whatever the population, 13 billion, right? That are going to fuck with your shit. And there's also going to be that same that will not. 
Yeah. Yeah. Feel I me? say that all the time, Feel man. Yeah. I was like, bro, I dead said ass. that shit last podcast. That's crazy. I was dead ass said that shit. I was like, bro, there's 8 billion people. You only There's going to be a few million out of the 8 billion that fuck with you. You know what I'm saying? And that's all you need is that actual fan base that fucks with you. <laughs> yeah. And that's it, bro. It might, that's why it's like, it's true, bro. Like, when I was younger, bro, I was a little bit more ignorant. I used to be like, yo, that's just straight trash. Now I just say it's not for me. Straight up. That's all I say is like, it's bro, it's just me. not for me. You know what I'm saying? Because the way you I say might, it. Yeah, oh, really? I might yeah. think it's trash, bro, but other people fuck with it. It's not trash. You know what I'm saying? To them. So it's just, it's, it's all subjective, bro, when it comes to music. Straight bro. up. Straight the fuck up. Yeah, bro. Even fucking Drake said that shit at the Grammys and they cut him off. Because they want they want everybody to think it's like not that. Yeah. That right. is not like that. Like, oh man, like they really want people to think like this is the best guy in the mm-hmm. industry. This is the best guy in It's R&B. all manipulated. Yeah, and it's kinda like it's not fair, you know what I mean? And we all know them numbers ain't real. No. And uh, I mean that's marketing. You yeah. see what I'm trying to say? Exactly. That's marketing. Yeah, you just it's just buy, like you McDonald's those putting numbers. out commercials. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's marketing. Yeah, you and they can they so. can pick and choose on who's gonna be on the front page when you click Apple Music and and Spotify. They like, do. You know, they did it to Tory Lane. They Lanes. manipulate all that shit, bro. You know, he said that Tory Lane shot like he was talking about the whole industry and how it was like it was all manipulated and you know with the whole Megan the Stallion thing. Now now look at it. They were trying to cancel cancel Tory. And look, now Megan looks like she's the fucking liar. They're like, going to owe that, that yeah. man an apology, Yo, yeah, bro. That everybody's going to owe More than an apology. They're going to owe him a few checks. Yeah. Because he lost out on millions of fucking dollars over some bullshit that they knew the whole time probably that wasn't true. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, that's fucked up. But honestly, in my opinion, I don't think we'll see it. I, I mean, said it before. I don't think we'll see it. Yeah, like, I mean, I'm being real. Like, the industry is, like, really something from publicity to marketing, to, mm-hmm. I mean, it's always been controlled. It's always been like, think about it like this. Like now we have artificial intelligence. So that's what it's all about. The whole world is changing, right? Mm, From yeah. in, in industrial world to artificial intelligence, yeah. right? So then now you got a lot of marketing and shit that's being done, like how you said, them doing numbers, them yeah. doing all this, because that's what they have to do now. Back in the day, right, with records, they used to literally take, and some of the greatest artists, like I just said, Michael Jackson, right? Mm-hmm. When they sold Thriller, Thriller is the most sold album ever in the world, right? But, how did that even happen? I'll tell you. Just like how they did with a lot of other artists' records when they had LP45s, you know what I mean, vinyls back in the day. Yo, radio fucking, well, no, radio, obviously, they got payola. You see what I'm saying? So the back end people, they got paid to, to stream, yeah. or not stream, but, you know, play the tracks. Yeah. But mm-hmm. then, also, they would send in people to go to the record stores and buy out all of the albums, every single copy for Thriller. You want to know why? Because as soon as Thriller releases and they have somebody go there, buy out all the copies, when somebody go and ask and they say, hey, I want to get Michael Jackson's Thriller, they say, I'm sorry, we just sold out. Mm. You're like, yo, I got to go get that album, yo. Yeah. Mm. Sales. It's manipulation. Mm. Yeah, yeah, right. It's exactly. all manipulation, Marketing. bro. When Drake went to the store and bought all the J. Cole CDs, you remember that? Remember that clip? Were. When, when you didn't see that? When, uh, when he first dropped that, that his first album. But and but it's but it's business. It it's is business. nothing personal. It's it it's always been business. Man, Drake's and buying all them albums. There's a reason for that. I'm gonna buy them now. Mm-hmm. Facts, facts. Mm-hmm. There's ways of doing things, bro, and helping. It's people just out. an investment yeah. into your own shit, because then all those that's album sales going yeah. through the roof. Yep, and you're gonna get that money straight back. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna make all your numbers grow. But yeah, man, it's crazy, bro. Like it, there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of manipulation, and honestly, it's all about money, bro. Like. The more money you have, the more marketing you can pay for, the more numbers you can buy, all that shit. It's just, it grows and grows and grows. Exactly. Straight up. But listen, man, I'm going to tell y'all what. We appreciate everybody for rocking, liking, sharing, Word subscribing. Up. Don't forget, go down in the description. Check my dog, Master Q out, man. He got some music, bro. He got some heat in the tuck, man. Y'all go check him out. And listen, man, we appreciate you, all right? Tell somebody you love them, and we'll catch you on the next one. Peace and love. Peace and love. Peace and love.